Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of the Washington Redskins franchise here on Madden 20 and today we have a huge divisional matchup against the 6-3-1 New York Giants. We are at home undefeated at 10-0. This is a big matchup for the squad. We played excellent defense in the last episode winning 24-6 against the Indianapolis Colts and we are looking to continue that great defense while playing better offense. Let's get it. Right, so here we go. Big matchup, divisional matchup in the NFC East. This is huge. You know the quarterback for the New York Giants, Garrett Hoke. He's always in the MVP conversation. Jabril Peppers is a huge player for them now. We have our own big guns to bring out. Tyler Morris coming out in this one. He hasn't had the greatest jump to his starts this year nine touchdowns five interceptions he looks to improve himself as we go throughout the season there is jeffrey moore with a 16 yard run to open up the ball game i know he's a huge fan favorite and he starts this ball game off right now second and ten morris with some time gonna throw the slant joey bowen with the big catch in the stead of the injured ashley Heyman. so now second and eight it's gonna be jeffrey moore Nice run, six yards on the play. It'll leave a third and three for the Redskins, and they'll give it to Jeffrey Moore again, and he makes a lot out of nothing. That's his fourth run for 28 yards, and the Redskins continue to move on the Giants. Now the fake to Jeffrey Moore, but the big sack from K.J. Wright signed with the New York Giants last offseason. He makes the big sack. There's the throw right side. That's going to go to Bodden. And Bodden going to be able to make this a third and seven for Washington. And he will make the third and seven catch and take it past the marker for a first down. So Daquan Bodden, two early catches for him as Morris goes three for four. So now third and eight, the big throw to Joseph Vick for the touchdown. And the Washington Redskins take the seven nothing lead early here at home in front of the fa Redskin faithful now. Garrett Hoke, the MVP candidate, 19 touchdowns, 15 interceptions for him so far on this season. He will hand it off to Saquon Barkley. And Saquon going to pick up seven yards on this play. Last week, 77 yards. He's already over 1,100 yards on the ground this season. This is week 11. There's Dre Harris coming in with the huge sack. And that is going to get the ball back for the Redskins, but Jabril Peppers on the safety blitz. It's going to make it rough on the Redskins. A third and 20 for them. Wide open man. It's Joseph Vick. He's easily going to get past the first down marker. And the Redskins moving again. So here's Jeffrey Moore again, and another nice run for him. That's going to leave a second and six for Washington, and they will give it right back to him. And he will find his way past the first down marker with a first down for Washington. First and ten, and why not continue with the hot hand in Jeffrey Moore? He will instantly pick up a first down for the Redskins, and that'll end the first quarter with the Redskins up 7-0. Back after this. And we're back here to start the second quarter. It's Jeffrey Moore, and he gets another handoff, his fourth straight. He'll pick up six yards on that one, and on second and four, a passing play. And here's Morris, and that's going to get intercepted as Jeffrey Moore, not really a receiver, didn't really know how to play the ball, and Justin Coleman ends up with the pick for the Giants. They'll get the touchback, and Saquon Barkley. We'll pick up 10 on first down to make it first down yet again. Here is a play fake from Hoke. He gets the ball away to his tight end. And a very nice play by Garrett Hoke with pressure in his face. So now third and nine for the Giants from the Redskin 46 as they're starting to move the ball a little bit here. Throws right side to Evan Ingram. That's going to be a gain of five, but no first down. No field goal attempt and a punt from the Giants. Jeffrey Moore continuing to be the workhorse with his 10th carry for 63 yards. Now on second and four, hit from behind by K.J. Wright again. Another big sack. 
by these giant linebackers. So now third and 10, Tyler Morris needs an open man and he throws into some coverage and that's gonna get intercepted by Damonte Kazee. He was doing the work on John Ross. So first and 10 Giants, here goes Saquon. Another instant first down. Big hit from Landon Collins, but it does not jar the ball loose. Saquon Barkley tackled at the 21 for a first down. Giants on that ensuing first down. A slant play. Sterling Shepard will make the catch. He takes a pop from Landon Collins as well. No fumble. Second and goal. Throw. Sterling Shepard for the Giant touchdown. They'll tie it up. And now Jeffrey Moore on first and 10. He'll pick up a gain of eight. So now second and two for the Redskins. Tyler Morris, he's got a little bit of time. He throws to the open man, Daquan Bodden, brought down at the giant 44. Redskin again in enemy territory. Morris this time will go down. That's at the hands of Levante David again. The giant linebackers really doing a good job getting through the gaps late. Now second and 16, it's a screenplay. Jeffrey Moore. Doing what he knows best. Look at that. Getting through the traffic and a lot more than the first down as he's tackled at the 25. Third and nine later on. Big throw to the end zone and John Ross can't come down with it. Knocked away by Whitehead. And that'll lead to a Washington Red Zone field Redskins field goal attempt. And it is good just inside the right upright. For the 10-7 lead for Washington, Will Lutz good on that one. Here's a big throw from Hoke on first and 10 in the two-minute warning for a big first down. They're in the hurry up, and Hoke going to go down. John Allen gets in for a big sack. Now second and 16. There's a throw on the check down. Sterling Shepard, and he will pick up a few yards. It'll be third and seven at this point, and another check down over to Saquon. Nowhere to really go, and from the 50, Giants would punt. So the Redskins, another chance here before the half, and here's a big throw and a big catch for Joey Bowen trying to get towards the out-of-bound markers. He is able to do so, so now the clock starts again. First and 10, knocked away by Jabril Peppers. Excellent defense. So that'll go to second and 10. Here's a throw, and that's going to be Joey Bowen. He has been huge on those come-across crossing routes. And that'll get the Redskins a first and 10 from the 33. And another throw, this one, John Ross. John Ross got the speed. And he is going to get out of bounds at the 10-yard line for the Redskins. Redskins giving trouble here to the Giants. But Levante David with the interception. Missed tackle by Moses Burrio. And there is nobody else that is going to be able to catch up to him in such a short time. Jeffrey Moore gave chase, but Levante David has a pick six for the giant, giant defense, and that is going to take us into the locker room down 14 to 10. A little bit disappointing there, but we'll be back after this. Back from the halftime break. The Giants with the ball here and the lead. There's a nice throw over to the sidelines. That'll be caught. It'll leave a third and eight, however, though. And here goes Garrett Hoke. And Garrett Hoke going to pick up the first down with his legs. Gotta love it. Here is a first down carry for Saquon Barkley. Nowhere for him to go. Loses two. It'll be third and 12 after an incompletion. And Garrett Hoke takes off again. Garrett Hoke trying to get to the marker. He will get brought down just shy. Just two yards shy of the first down marker by Hughes. So now out of the Wildcat come the Redskins in their next possession. And Jeffrey Moore does everything he can. But just going to get caught behind the scrim line of scrimmage by two yards. It'll be second and 12. There's the screen play over to Jeffrey Moore. He's got some room here to work. And he will get caught just shy of the first down marker to bring up a third and one. Here's a throw. Daquan Bodden will get the first down and more as he gets to the 39-yard line. So now second and 10, 12 for the Redskins on their next set of downs. And look at John Ross. He's just trying to outrun the defender, and he will. Touchdown, John Ross and the Washington Redskins as they will take the lead back. 17-14 this time. Here's a throw right side. Sterling Shepard going to make the catch. He will get brought down at the enemy 45. Now from the 42, it's a third and seven for the Giants. Play fake to Saquon. 
Hoke going to run with it again, and Hoke will get past the first down marker to the 33. This will be the last season. Garrett Hoke will get to wear number 10. Here's third and four, and knocked away by Sean Dion Hamilton. The Giants do have a ceremony planned to retire Eli Manning's old number. As you see the field goal there from Aldrich Rosas as he will tie this ball game at 17. So now first and 10 for the Redskins. It's Jeffrey Moore. He will pick up an instant first down with a 12-yard carry as the third quarter starts to come to a close. Play fake. Big sack. Samson Abukum. His first of the evening and fifth giant sack of the night. Last play third quarter. Jeffrey Moore going to run it. He will pick up six. That will take us to the end of the third quarter. As we go into the fourth quarter, it is a tie ball game at 17. Here we are to start the fourth quarter. Third and 12, Jeffrey Moore, big run. And that's going to be a nice nine-yard run. However, it is not good enough to get the first down. Redskins punt, first and 10. Hoke throws short right side. It loses a couple. Here's third and 12 for Hoke. He's going to run again on another third down. He is brought down shy of the marker, and the Giants will have to punt. Here's Johnston to kick it away. He is going to kick it away to Joseph Vick. Joseph Vick takes the punt, goes to his left. He's got wide open field in front of him, and he is going to run down the left sideline all the way to the Giant 39. Really short field for the Redskins. One of their shortest fields of the season that wasn't brought on by a turnover. Here's a big throw to Daquan Bonin. He's got plenty of room. He'll get to the 10-yard line. Tyler Morris making some big plays, some big throws down the field. Here's first and 10 for Morris. He's trying to get away from his would-be sacker. He gets away from one, but Samson Abukum gets to him again for the second time tonight. So now second and 12. Here's Morris surveying the field, throws end zone. He's got the touchdown. Joseph Vick for the second time today, his fifth touchdown of the year. Puts the Redskins up seven points with 5.22 to go in the game. Hoke, he's going to take off on first and ten, and he will slide for a gain of six. Now Hoke looking, surveying the field. He'll take off again, and he will slide again. That's a gain of 11 and a giant first down. They're moving down the field. Hoke on first and ten. This time will throw. He will get Sterling Shepard, and that is going to be a completion of eight. So second and 12, second and two for the Giants now as they got a man in motion. They will give to Saquon Barkley. Easy first down pickup. And that'll bring us to the 305 mark in this game. Hoke was thinking about running. He throws and just overthrows a wide open Golden Tate. Now on second and 10, he will throw to Golden Tate. It'll be complete. It'll be a six yard gain. And make it a third and four for the Giants now. There's a throw, got a, got a man, got a catch to Evan Ingram for the Giants first down at the 22 of the Redskins for the two-minute warning. Throws right side, knocked away. Landon Collins with a great deflection. Now second and 10, Hoke, big catch for Golden Tate. He has it at the six. A minute 30 to go. Giants throw left side. That's going to be complete to Evan Ingram. Clock ticking away, third and goal throw. Sean Dion Hamilton comes up with the interception. His third of the year. That is big. The Redskins waste some time and go three and out. There's a big throw to Sterling Shepard by Hoke, but Shepard could not come down with it. Now second and 10 with under 40 seconds to play. Hoke going to throw short left side to Engram, but he stays in bounds. Big tackle from Buchanan. Now third and five, they're going to throw it to Ingram again. And another big tackle to keep him in bounds. And that would end the ball game. The Redskins pull out a really close one here. It was not as close as the yardage would suggest. The Giants' three takeaways really helped them out in this one as it pretty much took a couple Redskin touchdowns or at least Redskin field goals off the board in this one. Tyler Morris was good 16 to 26 for 316 he had three touchdowns the three mistakes kind of erased themselves throughout the course of the game garrett hoke a worse quarterback rating jeffrey moore had 108 yards on the ground 
Between Barkley and Hoke, the Giants had 99 yards on the ground. John Ross, 86 and a touchdown. Joseph Thick, 61 and two scores for him. Joey Bowen with 57. Daquan Bodden with 78. So a nice spread for the top receiving targets on our squad. We're able to pull that one out. Moses Burrio gave up two sacks. I mean, that's kind of an everyday occurrence for the man. Anthony Buchanan led the team with eight tackles today. Bo Tatum had five and two for loss. Stallings had five and two for loss as well. So nice to see a lot of different defenders getting after it. It was kind of defensive in moments, but more between the 20s. They kind of let some things up, but Sean Dion Hamilton, big interception in the end zone. Kind of saved the game, really. It was important. The Giants, without that pick six, they wouldn't have been as in it as they were. So here's some upgrades. We got Bishop, we got Buchanan, we got Drew Hobart, we got Roland Overton, we got Joseph Bick, Kevin Bach, Ross Mackey, Ramon Jacoby, Cade Logan, all getting things. And we will get Ashley Heyman back in the next game, which is great. We'll have our slot guy back. It'll be great to have him there. Looking at some of the award races, Cam Newton leading the MVP race, McCoy leading the Coach of the Year race, and we'll look at the NFC awards only as Cam Newton for Offensive Player, Mack for Defensive Player, just over Dave Zimmerman. So Zimmerman's got a shot, Bo Tatum's on there, Keon Wild's on there, and Sean Dion Hamilton is on there as well. So that's pretty interesting to see. Offensive Rookie of the Year right now is Daquan Bodden. You'll love to see it. Ashley Heyman also being given a chance. Zimmerman for Defensive Rookie of the Year. You got Buchanan on there as well as Stallings. So a lot of good guys on that list for us. Jeffrey Moore, running back two in best running back. Best receiver, we don't have a dog in the fight on that one. O-line, though, we're getting considered. Scherf, Kelly, Tepper, Borio. Four of our five offensive linemen, Jonathan Allen, Donovan Stallings. So both of our defensive ends and Dre Harris at D-tackle. Three of our four defensive linemen are getting considered. John Dion Hamilton at linebacker. We got Zimmerman and Keon Wild at DB and Buchanan. So three of our three starting corners. And then Will Lutz, of course, being considered for kicker. We are taking on the 6-5 and five Seahawks like next time. Let me know what you think is going to happen in that game in the comments section below. Thank you guys so much for watching this. Don't forget to drop a like on this video as well as subscribe if you're new to the channel. And can't wait to see more Redskins franchise content all day, every day. You're a pretty little star boy. Look what you've done.